Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to have you all here today because today I'm going to be showing you guys two raw vegan breakfast recipes that you guys can enjoy first thing in the morning. If you guys haven't already, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Blooming Raw to keep up with me daily and also don't forget to subscribe for more upcoming videos. Alright guys, let's get started. For our first recipe, we're going to be making a Cinnanut Berry Ranola Crunch Cereal. I'm going to be using my Namawell Vitality 5800 juicer. This juicer is great for not only nut milks like we're about to make right now, but it's wonderful for sorbets, dressings, sauces, and so much more. First, we're going to start off making our nut milk for our cereal. You'll need some raw cashews or preferred nut of choice, soaked for at least 8 hours. 1 teaspoon of cinnamon and 1 half to 1 whole vanilla bean. And 2 to 4 cups of some fresh young coconut water. We're going to start by adding in our soaked cashews into our juicer while adding in our coconut water as we go. Then we're going to add about 1 to 2 dates to our cashew milk to make it even sweeter. You can leave this out if you'd like. Look how delicious, smooth, and creamy this cashew milk looks. Yum! Then with a strainer, we're going to pour our cashew milk into a bowl of choice to catch all the excess pulp. So I went ahead and scraped out the vanilla bean off camera and placed it in my nut milk. Now it's time to add in our cinnamon. Now we're going to go ahead and pour our delicious cinnamon vanilla cashew milk into a mason jar. And voila, our cashew milk is all done. It's raw, vegan, rich, creamy, dairy, and cruelty free. Yum! For cereal, I'm adding some sprouted Cocoa Crunch Granola from Go Raw. Now we're going to add in our raw cinnamon vanilla cashew milk. For toppings, I'm adding some fresh blueberries here. I'm also adding some raw almond and walnut butter. And here, I'm just adding a bit more raw Nola Crunch cereal. I also decided to add some frozen raspberries off camera. For sweetener, I'm adding some raw agave nectar from Wholesome. You can add coconut nectar here instead if you prefer. And we're all done! How yummy, sweet, and savory does this breakfast recipe look? Our first recipe is complete. For recipe number two, we're going to be making a frosty cotton candy nice cream. For this recipe, you're going to need 8 to 12 frozen organic bananas, 1 half to 1 cup of frozen raspberries, these are kind of thawed out a little bit, 1 scoop of Sun Warriors Tahitian vanilla protein, 1 cup of frozen strawberries, and water for a smooth blend. Look how beautiful the pretty pink cotton candy color of this nice cream looks. Yum! For toppings, we're going to add a blend of frozen mixed berries and some finely shredded coconut flakes for that extra holiday flair. There you have it, our frosty cotton candy ice cream recipe is complete. Now that we have both of our recipes, it's time for a taste test. Alright guys, let's give it a try. Oh, it's so good and so sweet. Now it's time for our cotton candy ice cream. Let's give it a taste. Oh, so good. 
All right, guys, well, that wraps up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed these recipes. Don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and comment below which one of these recipes you'd like to try. Also, feel free to follow me on Instagram at Blooming Raw. And as always, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification to be notified of when I upload another video. Until next time, bye.